Hi everyone, today I'll be discussing my very first love, poetry. Today the book in focus is Soft Magic by Upile Chisala, a Malawian writer and poet. Now one thing I find most intriguing about the book is from the very beginning to the very end, the author is dedicated to self-love. The author is dedicated, when I mean dedicated, I mean absolute unquantifiable dedication to self-love especially the black love she's dedicated to the love of color she's dedicated to healing and we all know that in order to heal properly and wholly we have to love ourselves we have to encourage ourselves now the book soft magic is is a compilation of poetry different poetry all encouraged to keep the reader above hate above self-disgust above hate it is encouraged to to immerse you in the beauty that exists within you and also around you now the author focuses on the black culture like if you read her book if you read the book the the most of the poetry ranges from self-love to the recognition and the struggle of the black race in society, in fitting in, in standing out. She recognizes this struggle. She takes them into focus and she has been able to coin words that are uplifting and that are encouraging. And I promise you, I promise you, poetry books are meant to be read by everyone. It is not... Um, it is not dedicated to a certain set, set of people, no. Poetry is meant for everybody. Poetry is something that calls you in, pulls you in, gives you a place to relax. It says, here is my bosom, come in and let me give you a rest. Now, Upile Chilasa is telling us to come into our soft magic, you know. Recognize the fact that you're beautiful, you're lemon and honey at the same time, you know. You're soft and sweet and you can be mean and brutal as well now the balance is what she focuses on the balance of all this in order to produce a beautiful human someone who is splendid in all our glory and i i really really believe you would love it at first the words might not call to you but once you get reading somewhere in between the lines you begin to see that this person is actually talking about me you know this person really knows the struggle. This person really understands what it feels like to be in a situation that isn't working. This person knows what it means to seek healing, to find healing, to hold on to healing. And above all, to live above survival. So, I encourage us all to get a copy of Soft Magic so we can also discover our very soft magic. I love you. Thank you for listening in. Bye.